In this video, we'll balance the equation for HCl plus O2. It gives us this water here and chlorine gas. Kind of an interesting reaction. You can use this. You can feed air through this solution of hydrochloric acid, an aqueous solution, and it can be used to produce chlorine gas. Let's balance the equation. We have one hydrogen, one chlorine, and two oxygens. Product side, we have the two hydrogens, two chlorines, and one oxygen atom. Let's start by balancing the hydrogen atoms. Here, since we have oxygen by itself, chlorine by itself, those will be easy to fix. So we'll start with the hydrogen. Let's put a two in front of the HCl. One times two, that'll give us two hydrogen atoms. For chlorine, one times two, that'll give us two chlorine atoms. This does present a bit of a problem now because our oxygens aren't balanced. So if we put a two here, that'll give us one times two. That'll balance the oxygens, two times two, That'll give us four hydrogen atoms. So we're going to have to change our coefficient here to four. So we'll put a four in front of the HCl. One times four, we have four hydrogens. One times four, we have four chlorines. That's good, though. We could put a two here, two times two. That'll give us four chlorines. We're done. This equation is balanced. So that's it. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for HCl plus O2, hydrochloric acid plus oxygen gas. Thanks for watching.